before we jump in and solve this, I want you to learn some algebra. What is the algebra that I want you to learn? You have a plus b. You put a plus b square. This is a square plus 2ab plus b square. I know you're all shaking because you know this one. So I'm going to amp it up. You know, I know you know a minus b whole square. This is called expanding it. That is very easy. Whenever you're expanding something, you have to multiply and you'll find out. Even if you forget something, you can multiply and do. Factorizing, that is tougher. That is, if you have a square minus b square, that can be written as a plus b into a minus b. Lovely. So this also you may know. How do I get this? Your distributive property. Just do a into a plus a square. a into minus b minus ab. b into a, b a. b into minus b minus b square. Minus ab plus ab get cancelled. You have a square minus b square left. Lovely. Why am I doing all this? That has n cube and thousand. I know what you're thinking. Hang on, hang on. Not, not going to fall in place. So wait. So suppose given a cube plus b cube, that can also be factorized. That can be factorized as a plus b into a square minus a b plus b square. A cube minus b cube can be factorized as a minus b into a square. Plus a b plus b square. A cube plus b cube is a plus b plus here and minus here. A cube minus b cube is minus here and plus here. As part of what you have to do, multiply this beautifully and see if it comes back to this. If it doesn't come back to this, you know what you should do? You should scratch out all your work and try it. That works. It's worked for a thousand years. It'll work now. So this is an identity. This always holds good. So keep this in mind. Multiply that and convince yourself. Where are we going with all this? We're going to use this one. And how so? Think about this question. We have a cube sitting there. Right? So what is the greatest positive integer n which makes n cube plus 100 divisible by n plus 10? n cube plus 100. We should be able to write this as n plus 10 into something. And we have to find the largest possible n for which this will work. Lovely. Now I'm going to think about a multiple of n plus 10 that has n cube plus something in it. How do I do that? a plus b into something, some big thing is a cube plus b cube. n plus 10 into some big thing should be n cube plus 10 cube. This is the idea of factorizing. n plus 10 into something is n cube plus 10 cube or n plus 10 into something is n cube plus 1000. Brilliant. Now we are through. How so? Think about this. We know that our number n plus 10 is a factor of n cube plus 1000. Our question says, what is the greatest positive integer which makes n cube plus 100 divisible by n plus 10? Question is saying, n plus 10 is also a factor of n cube plus 100. Okay. We know that n plus 10 is definitely a factor of n cube plus 1000. Our question is telling us that n plus 10 is a factor of n cube plus 100 also. So think about this. This n plus 10 into a positive integer gives us this. Into some other positive integer gives us this. That's the definition of factor multiple. n cube plus 1000 is a multiple of this. n cube plus 100 is also a multiple of this. 12 is a multiple of 4. 28 is a multiple of 4. 12 can be written as 4 into 3. 12 is a multiple of 4, 4 into 3, 28 is a multiple of 4, 4 into 7, 12 plus 28 will also be a multiple of 4, 4 into 10, 28 minus 12 will also be a multiple of 4, 4 into 4. If this is a multiple of 4 and this is a multiple of 4, some of these two will be a multiple of 4, difference of these two will be a multiple of 4, we have seen that. There's no point doing some of these two. We'll have two n cubes sitting there. 
we find the difference between these two we are going somewhere r r beautifully we know that n plus 10 is a factor of from n cube plus 1000 we subtract n cube plus 100 we get 900 r number n plus 10 is a factor of 900 brilliant now i'm going to rejig this entire question and write only one statement oops maybe i should not have shown you this let it be there it doesn't matter n plus 10 is a factor of 900 so i'm going to change this entire question to reach this point n plus 10 is a factor of 900 what do i want to find i want the largest positive integer n for which this is possible the largest factor of 900 is 900 so the largest possible value of n plus 10 is 900 if n plus 10 is equal to 900 then n equals 890 the largest possible value of a n 